like and subscribe right now or this spider will crawl on your face in your sleep. Disturbing videos are all over the dark side of YouTube and you probably haven't bumped into one and it's probably for the best because these videos are so disturbing and just outright creepy, so make sure that you're brave enough to watch till the end. We made this video especially for people like you who really wanna experience the creepiness of YouTube's dark side. Welcome back to Trending 10, and if you wanna see more trending videos just like this, you'll enjoy this channel. Christopher Hill, Abandoned Hospital. Christopher Hill is a YouTuber and an urban explorer from Ohio who investigates an abandoned hospital in Warren and that's when he bumped into something so disturbing. In light of the fact that the hospital has been vacant for over a decade and is about to be demolished, Christopher chooses to investigate the structure before it gets demolished. Little does Christopher know that deep within the hospital, an ominous presence appears to be hiding. Christopher enters the facility without encountering anything unusual, but when he gets to the underground passageway located deep within the hospital, Christopher discovers something strange. Here, come take a look. It appears that Christopher isn't aware of the shadowy figure by the door. It was only after viewers had pointed this out that he noticed. Now, it could be the case that this was someone who was squatting. But upon a closer examination, it doesn't seem like this might have been a squatter, nor does it look like this might have been a person. Alyssa Lamb When guests at LA's Cecil Hotel complained about the taste and color of their water in 2013, no one expected a woman's body to be discovered in the building's water tank. Police suspected foul play, however, reports revealed that Alyssa Lamb had drowned. The case's mystery further deepened after the hotel's CCTV footage was made public. Lamb's final clip shows her in an elevator, where she appears to shift between a childlike game of hide and seek and true dread numerous times. The video has been viewed millions of times on various YouTube channels, sparking a slew of ideas about Lamb's final moments. Many people believe the video shows her hiding from someone chasing her, while others believe it shows her having hallucinations that drive her to commit herself. Other theories speculate that the footage is supernatural, but in any case, it is as unnerving as it is intriguing. My Sister My Sister is a video uploaded to YouTube in 2011. It appears to show a woman trying on various clothing for the camera. The video begins with the woman staring into the camera with an unchanging smile and without blinking, but it quickly becomes considerably more menacing at the one minute mark. The woman approaches the camera after styling her third dress and removes the mask she's been wearing, revealing her true face beneath it. The video then transitions to a woman eating various foods before returning her gaze to the camera and pushing the base of her face away from the camera. Her face expands out as she's wearing a second mask. But the video ends before we get a conclusion. Although no one has been able to discover any other source for the clip, the channel was posted to as primarily a gaming channel, and my sister stands out as an odd exception. Benjamin Bennett Staring Contest Benjamin Bennett has one of the weirdest contents ever. In his first to 300th video, all of them feature him sitting smiling and staring directly at you. Bennett's odd commitment to the work can be seen in each video, which lasts over 4 hours. At some point he even pisses all over himself while sitting, and he stares straight ahead while someone breaks into his residence and enters the room. Bennett has never explained why he is doing what he is doing, despite being interviewed about it. He claims he isn't sure himself. For four years he has been doing the same thing and he has like hundreds of the same videos. But recently, he's had a recent change in the channel, although with the same overall creepiness. Blank Room Soup The first appearance of Blank Room Soup was in 2014. An unnamed man is seen crying while ingesting the contents of a dish with a large spoon in the video. Two strangely dressed figures pet him while he eats, as if comforting him. Raymond Percy, a performer, was the owner of these costumes. The suits are his figures from the Ray Ray sketches, but Percy claimed that the costumes had been stolen. He then received an email containing a clip of his own characters moving perfectly like they used to, with no explanation. The individual has never been recognized, 
So we don't know what happened to him, and we don't know what the soup is. But some have speculated that it's a human remains and that the video came from the dark web. Some people believe it's fake, but the truth may never be disclosed. Dark Web Encounter this 11 minute clip, which has been circulating on the dark web for quite some time, has only recently come to the public's attention. A human shaped object is taped together and stored in various strange situations in the footage, including in a chair, at the bottom of the stairs, and so on. It's gotten to the point where he's trying to feed it in the tub, despite the fact that it doesn't have a mouth. He places the object on the kitchen counter and begins hacking at it with his knife at the end of the movie. This video was shot in black and white and it features multiple camera angles. Although there are numerous videos like this on the dark web, I feel that every now and again, you might be witnessing somebody who is truly carrying out their sadistic wishes on a real person. It's entirely plausible that this is the aftermath of a Red Room video. This video is easily available on YouTube and it's bothersome. Robot Dancer This video, as awful as it is, takes the cake. A worn out robotic stripper dances up against a mirror in the video. The robot has a black goblin like mask and is dressed in white underwear. It seems like it is dragged behind a car because its entire body is covered with mud and dust. The stripper dances to Lady Gaga's applause in a rhythmic manner. The fact that the robot is designed to look directly into the eyes of everyone watching it while performing is what makes the video so frightening. Halfway through the video, the music stops and we realize that the stripper robot is actually stripping while muttering a long, barely understandable message. Bjork Obsession Ricardo Lopez, also known as the Bjork Stalker, is a 21-year-old single man who has an unhealthy crush on the Icelandic pop star Bjork. He was trapped in a psychotic conflict between loving and condemning her. While his obsessive romantic obsession spurred his delusions, he also developed a dislike for her after learning she was in a committed relationship. He intended to kill her by sending her a letter bomb. He also intended to commit suicide so that they may be reunited in the afterlife. He taped numerous hours of VHS recordings that documented his fixation and his evil plan. He recorded himself towards the end of the tape committing suicide with a shotgun. The cops discovered his body and intercepted the letter addressed to Bjork saving her and thwarting Ricardo's plan. This is one of the few suicide videos that has ever been left up on YouTube, and it's unclear why. It's not really of historical significance, it's obviously difficult to see, and it isn't intended for most viewers. The complete video is accessible on YouTube, and it's quite disturbing. Beth, Child of Rage The documentary was shot in Vancouver's Mary Hill Elementary School, a beautiful, innocent child turned into a cold-hearted sadist. In the video, Beth talks about her abuse as she abuses her brother, needless the family dog, and wishes they could murder her parents. After establishing Beth's feelings towards those around her and those who love her, the interviewer switches gears and asks about her upbringing before being placed in foster care. Beth's parents were found to have been physically, psychologically, and sexually abusive. Beth was never given a chance to understand how a normal person feels owning to her parents' abuse and neglect. This is where we'll end the video. Did you enjoy watching, or did we miss anything? Then leave a comment below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more videos just like this. Share this to your friends and family. Have a good one.